So maybe you could just start off by telling us uh, who you are and where you work. My name is Beverly Williams. I work in planning and I'm a senior buyer planner on uh, nutrition. All right. So Beverly, uh, what are you doing for Q3 Pure Transformation? Well, uh, this is the third time we've done a Pure Transformation and I did health goals earlier and this time I wanted to do a financial goal. Mm -hmm. So I tried to pick something that would be one thing I could do that would make a maximum impact and so I refinanced my mortgage. Wow. That was my goal. That's a big deal, huh? It it was. It actually took quite a bit of work Uh (laughs) to uh, get everything together and try to figure it out. But um, my long-term goal was to have my home paid off faster. Mm -hmm. So my previous mortgage, I had 26 years left. And with my current mortgage, I have 15 years left. Wow. So that's 11 less years of payments. Right. If I stick with it, and and about $55,000 less interest. It's it's a, just a total strategy change mm-hmm. to to get somewhere f- a lot faster, right? And then it's just started me thinking, well, what else can I do in fifteen years? Yeah. From from my experience, it seems like it's not going to be a big deal to identify a goal or to identify it to a quarter, but y- it really helps you make this the quarter that you do it. You know, so I probably I had this on my mind for years. I wanted to do it at the first opportunity, but. I probably did it faster because of pure transformation, and it gets me thinking, well, what's the next thing I'm going to do? Right. And so tying your goal to the time period that the company is working, um, I think, is, a, is helpful to keep it on your mind and, and to get it done quickly, and you probably get through more goals faster.